Hello, good morning. Okay, so I have two things in here that I want to show that I've been kind of working on and kind of not. All right, so here's what I've got so far. Let's see. Yeah, I need to work on it a little bit on wire wrapping. So I still need to work on that. Oh yeah, I need to definitely work on that. Look at look at that. <laughs> that looks terrible. Oh, that side looks terrible too. Well, this one's a little better. A little crooked. Yeah, this one's better. Maybe I'll redo this one. I think I'll redo this one. But anyway, so I was working on these as I drop them. I'm working on these because I'm going to make earrings out of them. Yeah, so I'm going to actually make some earrings. Um, this is a birthday present, so hopefully the person doesn't watch my video because otherwise she'll be spoiling her birthday present. So I have until March. Oh. Well, I have until the end of March. Because I was going to say, it's almost March already. I'm going to redo this one, though. No. Which one am I going to redo? The one that has the bad lines. I'm going to redo this one. Yeah. I'm going to re... Not on camera. But I'm going to redo that one. This one has nice circles. This must have been my first one that I tried following the guide for. Um, but anyway, I just figured I'd make a little video um, talking about where I've been and what I've been doing. I haven't been doing a whole lot of anything. Uh, just been tired from coming home from work and not not having any creative energy to do any beads but like I said I it, it did take some time and I did buy some jewelry wire some jewelry earring things uh, some jump rings and anyway so hopefully by the time I have these finished I'll have some nice earrings I don't know what I'm gonna dangle underneath them though I don't know what do you think Maybe I'll find something to dangle underneath them. I don't know. Maybe I'll dangle another another bead. Ooh, I could find a bead and and match. I tried to do these as best as I could matching wise. I don't know if I've got if they are matching beads. I just dug through my uh, my blue bag of beads and. Uh, found two that matched, so I'm I may may do that again. Find try to find two that match close enough, because I don't have. Here, I'll just show you my bag. And there's my bag, my big gallon sized bag of beads. So I went and I dug through here and tried to find two that match. See, like these two might match a little bit. Actually, those two match better. Ooh, maybe I could use these two right here. Those two look good. I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, I just figured I'd show you. I have a bag like this in green, and I have a bag like this in blue because I had so much blue beads, and I have so much uh, green beads. But what I've been doing lately when I, uh, um, when I string my beads and do my bead, uh, when I take them off the bead stringer or, you know, the drying rack or whatever, I don't know what you want to call it, my drying rack, um, I'll, I'll match them together and match them as sets. Here, I'll show you. And see, this is how I, uh, I, uh, string them now. So I, well, I didn't know that one was that big. <laughs> see, I like all these beads here. There's probably more somewhere, but oh my God, I can't even pick them up. There we go. Like these beads. Uh, 
There's some green beads here. So this is what I've been doing when I, uh, these are finished. These are all, they're already um, dipped and everything. These are the ones I'm interested in. These will make good earrings, maybe. Ooh, maybe I could make a pair of earrings out of these. That's all I made, was this much. Uh-oh, they're stuck together. There we go, got them broken apart. Those two were stuck together too. Hopefully they're not, they don't ruin anything by sticking. Anyway, I'm just going to mold this all into one video and uh, hopefully, but anyway, this is what I've been doing with them so I don't end up with a big bag like this um, when I sort them. So that's kind of what's been taking me a long time. Ooh, maybe I should make something with these beads. I like these. Anyway, I got so many in here that I like. Like, these remind me of turquoise beads. I don't know. So many beads in here that I just barely remember doing. Oh, and then when I find more, when I find more, I uh, stick them on. So I found more of this same bead in Instead of restringing it, I just kind of string it, up, string it on. What's this color? This is brown. Anyway, I'm not going to look through these. This is not what I was intending to do. So anyway, with these, I'm going to find two more beads that match well enough with these. I don't know. I'll have to look. Oop, there we go. Uh, two beads well enough that will match. And I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them. But anyway, these are what I've been working on. So anyway, uh, yeah, I have talked long enough. So I'm going to end this video here and call it good. Oh, look at that. There's a tiny one. See this one here? That means there's this color bead somewhere else. And same with this one. Aww. Okay. All right. Thanks for watching. Bye.